On to matters politics now. The Jubilee Party leadership has finally succeeded in removing its four lawmakers, Alfred Keter, Silas Teren, Kangogo Bowen, and James Gakuya from the positions of committee chairs in the National Assembly. The party says they were forced to crack the whip against the four who went against the party's wishes on regional balance. But as Duncan Kaimba now reports, the ousted members of parliament accused the presidency of being held captive by corruption cartels that want to ensure compromise members of parliament chair in the committees. It was a dramatic day at parliament as Jubilee Party stood its ground to weed out its renegade members who defied party position, contested and won leadership positions in four committees. However, except for Embakasi North James Gakuya, who succumbed to pressure and stepped down, the other three besieged MPs, Nandi Hills Alfred Keter, Cyrus Tiren from Oiben, and Kangogo Bowen from Marakwet East fought to the last minute. I was duly elected on 23rd of December. You cannot come and sit here. And, ima and start imagining that you can give a professional advice. It is wrong. You are part of the problem that you are trying to solve here. Keter's Labour Committee put up a spirited fight with NASA members of parliament, joining forces with Keter to scuttle first attempt to vote him out, forcing the committee to adjourn the session for five minutes. This prompted Jubilee Bigwig's majority leader Eden Duale and his chief whip Benjamin Washiali to show up in the committee and sit through until all the 10 Jubilee members present passed a vote of no confidence against the Nandi Hills lawmaker. Keter, together with NASA MPs, refused to vote, demanding secret ballot. The route we took in 2015.